All right, week three at Okiyama for the Super Formula. And not feeling as far off as normal, and I have yet to press the overtake button. So that has me feeling fairly good, but I also feel like I'm going to drive off or spin out in the slow corners. Good news is we're the number 15 out of 18, so our expectations are not very high. And we'll just try to do our best. I think we'll just sense that situation. We are low man. On I rating, we'll just stick with uh, not qualifying and get through the race. Just feel this out and practice real quick and haven't really been in a lot of dirty air, so I assume I'm going to have some struggles with that. Probably not taking that corner right, looking at the guy behind me, but maybe neither of us know what we're doing. Don't lock up the inside tire. So I've added more front wing into it, there's only one click left, and then I've just been adjusting the front end, trying to get a bit more turn. The last turn here is so tricky in this car, like it's not that hard in every other car, but man this car, it does not like it. Not attacking this corner enough, I know that, but I still almost go off, which is why don't attack corners like that, we'll just stay on track. You know what, I think I'm going to qualify on the race set, just out qualify anyone that's doing like 16s or 17s. And uh, maybe that'll get us ahead of anyone that might be really slow. Because I think I can... I did a 15 on race fuel. So, let's go do that. Make sure we don't uh, cool the tires off too much since... They lose a lot of pressure if you let the temps drop, and then I struggle with the feel on very low pressure. I just enjoy this car. It's nice to have something this fast that I can still handle. I'm not quick in it, but I also don't feel like I'm deadly in it. on throttle and that was not gonna be saved okay 
looks like we are starting last. I tried to get on it earlier than normal and take a little wider line and... Well, we found the limit. My limit. There's a little dip, a hump right there in the transition up the hill, and I think when we hit that, it just snapped it a little to the right, and then I overcorrected and it hooked. snappy now. Probably more my right foot than anything. One last shot. Oh, God. <laughs> Terrible exit. Let's just lose two tenths down the front stretch. up for that bad exit. Push wide, hit the dirt, nearly lose it. Lose another four tenths. somehow on the curb. That's where I'm afraid of spinning is through that section in some stupid slow spin. And 16-7, that should put us last. There's the flag, it's over. at the moment. Well, we get ahead of a couple of people. That will hopefully help. 13 is doing their final lap, I hope. And there we go. Nope. Never mind, I thought it switched over, but that was just me being getting off the track. Now we're going. All right, so we beat four people. Starting 13th, lucky 13. And, uh, yeah, only, you know, four seconds off pace and qualifying. Hopefully, I've got enough fuel. I lowered the fuel from what iRacing had because it was showing. You know what? I'm going to up that a bit. Just because I do tend to get faster as I go. And we'll probably start using more fuel, so go up a couple of clicks just in case. Let's just hope we can get through it again. Make all the laps. We've done that so far. We almost didn't at Fuji because we almost got lapped because I spun out twice. See if anyone misses the grid because we actually advanced before the eight minutes because everyone was ready. 
looks like everyone is showing up. Nope. That guy is gone now. Oh yeah, lots of wheel spin. More wheel spin in third. It's just slowing down my line. Right side. Almost losing on corner entry. That would have been dumb. Let's just calm it down a bit. We've settled in. We've lost the spot. No need to run into the back of anyone here. Thousand I rating that didn't qualify or screwed up his lap, so we'll just back off and let him go. All right. Not that Clear we're going to be able right. to hold him off, anyways. You got a slow car on the left. Someone has got on the gas a bit too hard. Thankfully, we can't run into debris. used to be able to, but then they found out that everyone was seeing debris in different spots, so that made it pretty unfair. on the button, so we'll just back off. Car right. Keep to the left. Clear. Big arrow push there. I don't know if it was arrow push or not, but nose did not want to do what it normally does there. Alright, so that drops us back to 14th. being a shorter track, probably going to get lapped. Only 73 seconds and we're losing two, three, five seconds a lap, so... We've got 2.2 behind us. Running one spot ahead of where we should be right now. I'm going to continue. 
need to just baby it around here and drive within my skill level. Pick up the pace eventually, but right now... The car in P1 just set the faster flat. 13.745. Right now we're doing okay. 2.2 seconds back. 16.501. Match our queue time. Tires are starting to feel a little better. Nose is starting to feel a bit quicker. ahead. That was weird. Well, I thought this guy was going to vanish a little quicker. I mean, he's eventually going to, but... Especially when we screw up that corner. 3.2. Alright, we're gaining a second on the guys behind. We're going to start treating the throttle a little gentler out of the corners like we're supposed to. One car though ahead of us is wrecked, so but it also took Red Bull Ring a bit to really fire off, so still could be some free spots coming. Oh my god, what am I doing? I looked in the mirror, seen someone had gained a ton on us and then drove off the track. Where did that guy come from? What the hell is he doing? The car in P1 just set the fastest lap. 13.289 the same guy that was 13 seconds be or 3 seconds behind us No, this guy hit on lap 2. Okay. Oh my god. All right, well, now I'm distracted and screwing up and Looks like we will drop into 14th. Although we gained a spot, so maybe someone had a penalty? Had to do a drive through or something? I have no idea what's going on. Just get him past us. He passed or he caught us by like five miles in a lap. Though he's our high rating, he's quick, but maybe he wrecks a lot. Or maybe we're just slow and should not have anywhere near a 2000 I rating. Not being comfortable in turn one is really hurting our laps, I think. Two and a half seconds behind. So we lost a second there. But I think we'll be okay. I think this one's going to be a boring one. 
We are a bit off pace. Maybe we get it figured out. Stop. Two point five behind still, so he is picking up speed. The leader's thirty one seconds behind. Sixteen point zero two. Still good on fuel. It does kind of look like we're catching the people ahead of the 14. I'm not sure if that's just an illusion or what, but. The car in P2 just set the fastest lap 13.199. Got a battle for the lead, it sounds like. Second place, picking up speed. Mm, slid the left front there on entry and just would not turn. All right, back to three and a half ahead behind us. 15.874. Really wanting to rotate on entry now. Four point eight seconds to the eight. We'll keep an eye on that. So lift off the brakes so that we don't keep blocking up that right front. The car in P1 just set the fastest lap, 13.07. when they start battling for position ahead, so might gain some back. I've just got to get a little more comfortable right now. Car is really, really, really grippy right now. It's just wanting to hold through the corners, so I am going a little too slow for it right now. just fast enough to stay on track. And we shifted to first for some reason. Sand off the corner there, 4.1 ahead. Still gaining on the guy behind. Don't know what I'm doing. Downshifting for a corner that I've never downshifted for. Point two to the eight. Someone 
is locked up or spun. Let's see if we gain a spot. Big no to shove there. 5.1 ahead to the 8. He has picked up speed, or we have just not continued to gain speed. are still really close to each other up ahead, so we might be getting a few free spots if people start racing. The car in P2, just set the fastest lap, 12.869. And as the race goes on, it's going to get harder and harder to get off the corner, so might see some mistakes and hopefully we aren't one of them. I feel like my speed through the last section has really slowed down, but... rotating on me. Not quick enough on the hands. Especially to the right. Alright, they are on top of each other up ahead. 5.3 seconds ahead. seconds ahead, 7.2 behind. Leader is not catching as quick as I thought they would. Too slow. If you're driving up the rumble strips on the inside. Track down the 16. seconds ahead.
it could be a disaster. Burn some of it up all the way through this first sector. us anything, but it doesn't look like we're going to be in a late battle we like we have been. Uh-oh. And that is the 16th, so that was probably the only person we were going to be able to catch. And he got on the gas and looped it, so I think that makes the rest of our race very boring, because I don't think we're catching the eight. Gets us back to our starting position. changing. But we might be able to finish all the laps. Leader's still quite a ways behind. So all I need to do is not spin out or wreck. We were heavy on fuel. Fuel usage has not went up. The car in D2 just set the fastest lap. 12.607. Jesus, 12.6. I don't know why I'm shifting up and down there. I just need to make up my mind on what gear I want to go through that. Oh, we hit the curve and pushed wide there. Had to back off.
nose is just shoving like crazy now. Six seconds. 15.196. I think Red Bull, well, at Fuji, we heated up the rears really bad. Red Bull ring didn't feel like we did much of a balance issue, but man, I am just, front tires are not having it today, but also went higher on the front pressures and lower on the rear than what the default was, so I kind of built that into it, but paying for it now, but luckily we're not in a race, we can just gonna get any attrition that happens. But sadly, a very, very, very boring video, unless you like watching an oval racer be bad at road. Off there, overdrove last corner. I need to not upshift. Isn't that's just making me stay on throttle longer? When I was doing my fast laps, I'm pretty sure I wasn't upshifting. Oh boy. That was ready to turn more than I was ready to turn. Seven seconds ahead, looks like they might be battling. 14 has lost the spot to the eight. Tried to damage the floor. 13 and a half behind to the leader. 
got a bit before we can use overtake again. Eight seconds behind. Eight and a half seconds ahead. They are just gone. I had my like few good laps in the middle and then it just has went away on me on handling. Fucking hell. There we go. We will get like 15th. We can't fix the damage. I'm afraid it's over. <sighs> so stupid. Such a stupid mistake. Absolutely no reason for it. And we're done. I mean, at least we weren't in a battle, but such a stupid unforced error. No need for that at all. And I just hit the overtake button to set it up for the exit, and I just big wiggle in, we push a little wider on the gravel into the fence. But these big ass baubles, that, that, just bad. And then we get on the gas, full throttle there, and no saving it. And done. Very, very dumb. Let's go take a look at any go. other Two issues that happened out there. I don't think there's going to be a whole lot. Six gets up on the uh, rumble strips and just gets on the gas too hard, and that's it. Nope, never mind. This guy's blinking. Thought that was it. Oh, he's just gonna run into the back of the car ahead of him, and that probably damaged his front end. Nope. Uh, maybe that was why he was losing speed. Same thing, 16. Just gets on the edge of that. And now he's just full throttle in the pits. And, well, we might have been able to catch him. That's That really makes me sad, because he did it just before us. Probably damaged his car. But we could have got another spot if he is way off pace. That one hurts. We'll see what he's doing. No, he's still doing 15s. We weren't going to catch him. Oh, disappointing. But it was bound to happen. So I uh, hope you enjoyed that. Thanks for watching.